Hey guys, so today I've decided to do a quick drawing of a rose for you. I, I decided to start with the stem and the vase as opposed to the rose itself because I wanted to be able to get the proportions correct. I spend a little bit of time evening out the vase and then I move up into the rose. To begin the rose, I drew the outline of a rose from a picture that I found, not bothering to fill in anything in the middle. I know it looks a bit crazy right now, but trust me, it'll look better once I've filled in everything. I, then I, start, I started with the petals closer to me, and I began layering them and filling them in uh, following the photo that I looked up on Google. Uh, eventually I moved into the center and realized that the rose that I had drawn was bigger than the rose in the picture and I ended up having to freehand some petals uh, but I really enjoyed doing this drawing and uh, I found it very stressful but in a good way like a good stress like it made me want to do better as you can see I have almost finished with the actual rose here and uh, I grabbed a pencil eraser to be able to clean up some lines better. Uh, I sharpened up a couple of the petals that had some more rounded points as opposed to like tips. Uh, and then I moved down and looked up a different picture of a rose to find some petals. Apparently rose petals, um, rose leaves, pardon me, uh, aren't like completely flat. Uh, and now I'm moving in the camera so you guys can see better. I drew some veins in the pen, uh, in there, and now I've decided to start the inking. So to do the inking, I didn't make it very clean and I didn't make it very, um, you know, exact because the way my drawing style and the way that I chose to do this drawing was very rough and very natural and kind of raw. So I didn't worry about being completely perfect, especially because the pen that I was working didn't enjoy drawing over pencil. Uh, and the inking itself ended up being very simple, and I am very happy with the outcome. Uh, I really hope that you guys like it as much as I do. After I've finished the inking, the last step is to erase all the pencil lines, and then go in with the actual eraser to clean up the ugly marks from that eraser. Uh, and now I'm done. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye!